go to crude oil in the five cent. A lot of traders inside and outside of the room that, that lease the software. And this is the new update I got coming for you on loosening up some more retracements. What the response I've gotten since we released the arrows is you'd like to see more deep retracement arrows that fire off. What I've done is I loosened up the um, I loosened up the retracements, meaning I've added more retracements to the program. So you're going to get more arrows. Now here's how you can do it this last couple of days. What you can do is if you look at the last couple of days, let's start over to the left. Anything on the magenta in May is going to be a deep retracement. And so you're going to get more arrows that fire off on retracements like this. This is going to be your sweet spot to trade. Right here. All right. Sweet spot to trade. It's going to be the magenta MA. First cross out is the best. You can tell the first cross break retest could be your best one. Now this one will be on the new. This didn't show up for you yesterday. Because I loosened it up, it's more of a shot, a more a shallow deep. I put it in there for you guys, but you can see if it it retraces right on the deep retracement, it's a good one. So this added three more air, or two more arrows here, and two more arrows yesterday for you guys. So the key, and this is just crude the last couple of days. What I want you to start concentrating on, especially the five sim, is this. Is look for the deeper retracement. And so it will be a simple file that you'll just send to you. It will overwrite your, your other file to show more retracements, to get more arrows, to give you more opportunity. The reason I'm doing that from all the emails I got is that a lot of traders are matching market profile up now with these arrows. I was doing very, very well. I'm going to try to get you enough arrows that fire on deep retracements now where you can trade off HVA, LVA, and the control point. And now you're going to get multiple opportunities off market profile and deep retracements. So that's going to help you guys and gals out instead of just sitting there trying to figure out if it's a deep retracement or not. You should have a corresponding arrow that's going to fire if it's deep enough. Now, it's not going to fire shallow, shallow retracements, but I did loosen it up enough to get more deep retracement arrows for you guys and gals to fire into. And that's going to assist you guys on trying to get some of these uh, deep retracement trades. And this little alone, that was eight trades alone the last couple of days that we had a nice advantage to selling deeper retracements. Okay, so uh, that'll be coming out in the email to you guys and gals. Um, here shortly and then uh, this week and then you'll just overwrite your uh, you'll just you'll give me instructions you'll just overwrite your other arrows and I added a little bit more arrows for you so you could uh, to loosen up um, to loosen up the retracements so what I'm going to be showing in the room I'm actually going to put that in the room now on both markets this morning and that's what we're going to be getting out to you I'll put that in the room now for you guys and gals so you can see it until we get the program out to you. That'll assist you guys. Oh, they can't override. I'm sorry. Just It's in the instructions. Gerald, you won't override it. Gerald has it, the instructions for you on how to, uh, on how to do that. 